Hi, I'm Todd. And I'm his daughter, Victoria. And welcome back to our channel. You know, a nice way to start off a Sicilian morning is with a delicious cannoli, a cappuccino, or espresso, or macchiato, mm -hmm. whatever kind of caffeine you would like. <laughs> as long as it's strong. <laughs> <laughs> right? So this morning we thought we'd treat you and we're going to make some of our uh, cannoli filling and uh, also some nice homemade cappuccinos as well. Sounds delicious. All right, you hungry, Victoria? I think so. Should we get started? Let's do it. All right, let's get ready. Okay. All right, now to start making our cannolis, uh, our ingredients that we have here today, we have, I like to use a little bit of mascarpone cheese in my filling. Uh, we have some powdered sugar. Uh, we have ricotta fresca. And here, what's really interesting, as you can see, that our ricotta fresca comes in this little basket, so it mm. drains nicely. Beautiful. And then we have some lemon. We're going to use the zest of the rind. And then uh, some little mini chocolate chips we're going to put in there. And then we're going to decorate the ends of our cannoli with some pistachio. Yep. And then we have the shell. And at a later date, we're going to show you how to make the shells. But this morning, Victoria really is hungry, so let's get started. We'll make that filling and we'll fill them and then we'll enjoy some cappuccino with our cannolis. Sounds good. Let's get started. Okay, so now that we've finished mixing our ricotta, our cannoli filling, we put it in a pastry bag, as you can see right here. And then we're going to pipe in the filling into the cannoli shell. You start in one side, start in the middle of the shell, and then work your way out. And I like to leave a little extra on the ends too. So when we dip it in the pistachio, you can have some delicious pistachio that sticks. Yum. And by starting in the middle, you make sure that there's no hollow in the center. All right, so we're going to continue filling these until they're all filled nicely. Just like that. Thank you. 
All right, so now that we've finished filling the cannoli shells and we put the pistachio on the ends, we're now gonna dust it with a little bit of powdered sugar. Just a little extra sweetness, because you know. And it makes them pretty. It makes them taste delicious with that little cappuccino. Beautiful. Voila, how do you like that, Victoria? I think they look good. I think we should now make the cappuccino. All right, let's do that. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna start making some delicious cappuccino. Well, hopefully they'll be delicious. I love this little machine here. And I love those cups too. I know. We bought them on the other side of the island in Ariche. Oh, that's right. Mm -hmm. That's actually where our favorite cannolis come from. <laughs> I know. <laughs> so at the same time, we're gonna be frothing some milk. Love this little machine. Oh, do you smell that? Yes, it saved our lives many, many times. <laughs> it smells so good. <laughs> uh, I think it's really nice and warm. Everyone watching this is going to now want a cup of coffee. I know. Again, one smell of vision would be fabulous. I love this machine because it makes a really beautiful, frothy espresso all on its own. It's mm. just stunning. All right, let's continue on, because I assume I'm not the only one that wants coffee today, right? I uh, know. All right, so now the coffees are all done. Look at those beautiful espressos. And at the same time, our milk is frothed. Look at that, isn't that beautiful? Mm -hmm. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna pour this in here so you get the milk, and then we'll put some of the froth right on top after. A little bit of that. Making that looks so good. Gorgeous cappuccino. See the froth is staying right at the top there. Mm -hmm. So we'll just ladle a little bit of that on in a second. Just put a little of this cream. Beautiful. Okay, keep this tipped. Get a little bit of that beautiful foam. Yum. Delicious. All right, so we finished making our cannolis and our delicious cappuccinos. So I think we're going to enjoy them. I think so, because they look and smell so good. They really Yum. Yeah. All right, so we'll post the recipe for you down below for the cannoli filling that we did today. And please don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on your notifications. And, oh. We have three cappuccinos. We do. Oh. Well, I guess we'll let mom join us this morning. Oh, all right. That's only fair. <laughs> all right. Okay, so we'll say ciao for now. Ciao. Ciao, ciao. ciao, ciao.
want a hollow cannoli. No. Yeah, you don't want a hollow cannoli. No. You don't want a hollow cannoli. No. You don't want a hollow cannoli. No. You don't want a hollow cannoli. No.